find sin 1 2 3 0 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1 2 3 0 now you should check 1 2 3 0 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1 2 3 0 lies between 1080 and 1260. This is 180 into 6 and this is 180 into 7. Okay. Next. Now 1230 is close to which number? This is close to 1260. So 1230 now should be written as 1260 minus 30. So this will become sign. In place of 1, 2, 3, 0, now we write 1, 2, 6, 0, minus 30. This is your first step. Next. Sign. Now in place of 1, 2, 6, 0, we should write 7 into 180, minus 30. Next. Here we have 180, so sign is not going to change, it will remain sign. And inside we get this angle 30. Now the question is, will we get here plus or minus? To answer that, we should look at the number before 180, that is 7. And 7 is odd, and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant. So now to select the quadrant, we should look at this symbol. Here we have negative. That means angle lies in the second quadrant. And in the second quadrant, sign is positive. So we should put plus. So plus sine 30 is 1 by 2. This is our answer.